It is not a lung. Do not be fooled. It was a conspiracy. It's a tiger! Morning! And it's a place again! The Kyo family vlog. Hello, and welcome to today's episode. I am currently sitting in squatting frog position, just chilling. Tibbs and I have been up since 8 o'clock, hanging out, playing, trying to fold laundry. Not being horribly successful, but we're getting there. I think I'm going to have second breakfast now because first breakfast wasn't enough. This guy has had like three breakfasts and still wants more. Yeah. Look at all these toys. Look at this perpetual mess that we now get to have. Oh, and that's the laundry. Um, that's totally going to get done later today. So stop staring at it, okay? Give me a second. Sean Boy is asleep. He actually had a really rough night last night. Poor thing. He was up until like 5 in the morning, really sick. I don't know what made him sick. Sometimes we know, sometimes we don't know. Last night, we don't know what made him sick. He was just sick. So, he finally fell asleep at about 6 something. And then we woke him up by accident. I didn't realize, you know. And though, so he went back to bed at like between 8.30 and 9. So he's still out. He's only had a couple of actual good hours so I'm gonna leave him be for a while because of that we are taking the day off from work today so I'm just gonna be doing stuff around the house let's see if I can find something entertaining to do while I'm at it also this morning I've spent a couple hours there was a an online seminar a webinar hosted by Heroic Academy which we really like they run out of uh, the Netherlands, it's Booty Vote and um, Tim Van Dorn and Tim was giving a webinar on mixing and mastering so I've been catching up on that. It was actually yesterday but they still had the link available so I was catching up on that. If you watch this and you're also um, into music like we are, especially with DAWs, digital audio workstations, and electronic music and that type of thing and you're looking for resources, I recommend them. Their name again is Heroic Academy. They have a lot of good resources um, whether you know hardly anything about it or whether you already know a lot of deep technical stuff they'll go even deeper for you. So it's pretty awesome. Shout out to them. Thanks guys. We appreciate your resources. Truly. Sean is awake now. It's after 12. So I'm catching him up on breakfast. Bacon. Tibbs finally went down for a nap. It was a conspiracy. I woke him up at 8 this morning. Rather he woke me up but I made him stay up. He just now went down for a nap so I'm hoping that if I do this for the next couple of days it'll fix his sleep schedule again because for a while there he was going to bed between 8.30 and 10 fairly easily like no problem you know. Hi Sunny. I didn't sleep last night I got really sick and spent most of the night up so I just woke up and that made me bacon so I'm eating bacon. And how do you feel? I have pretty bad migraine but that's just life. Luckily I'm at a point, point with work where I can just call up and say, hey, uh, I'm going to move this work to a different day because I have a migraine. And he's like, okay. That is quite convenient for us, I must admit. So, of course, a sick day for Sean means he's spending time with his favorite person, Harry Potter. So, now that we're moving on with our day a little bit, I have a sweet potato. This is the sweet potato that Tibbs will try. Now I'm going to give it to him later today. This morning he had some more avocado with me while I was having my second breakfast. So I'm going to slice this guy up probably like in like long strips so he can kind of hold it easier. 
And I'm just going to boil it until it's at that nice consistency that will work for him. Um, this sweet potato looks like a lung. It is not a lung. Do not be fooled. This is a sweet potato. I repeat, this is a sweet potato. I was thinking, you know, I really like to eat. I eat a lot. I like food. One of these days, our vlog should just be me showing you how much I actually eat in a day. Because you guys don't even see a fraction of it. <laughs> I promise you I eat as much as like probably an NFL player. It's up there, folks. I will have to prove it to you soon. Dad Corner is about to go out. And this boy is being a turd. Mom is trying to take care of him because I have a migraine and he have to finish making a thumbnail for Dad Corner. And Hibbs wants to be with Dad right now. What do you want? Mm. I have a migraine and have to work. <laughs> but he's so cute, I can't be mad at him for it. I love that my little boy loves me even if it's inconvenient. It's inconvenient. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, tell him. Tell him. Mm -hmm. Oh, Tibbs and I are updating the dry erase board. This picture has been up here since we moved here that I talked with Sean and it's time we do something fresh. Boom. Now I'll just have to draw something else. Tibby likes the family picture. I think I might move that up to the corner so it's a little more out of the way. What do you think, Tibbs? Tiberius? Hi. 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 You doing okay now? This poor kid has been so grumpy today. It's why I haven't been doing much vlogging yet. He's been incredibly fussy and grumpy the majority of today. I think he's actually starting to teethe. I mean, he's been teething for a while, but I think it's starting to really bother him to the point where it's making him grumpy finally. So we knew that this day would come and now it's here, <laughs> but now he's happy. Now he's happy. Yeah. What'd you think, buddy? <laughs> ah. Say hi. I love you, Tibbs. You crotchety old man in a baby's body. There. Tibbs already erased part of it with his curiosity. So I moved it up here. Oh, happy family. Don't ask about Sean's legs. He was injured in the war. You want to see something that makes Tibbs laugh. Hit, 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 hit. Dee, 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 dee. Is my hair crazy? Yeah, mom needs a haircut. <laughs> so yeah, unfortunately, Sean still feels like doo-doo on a stick. He has felt bad all day. Me and Tibbs have just been hanging out all day trying to minimize the uh, crying and whatnot since he's sensitive to noise today. But I thought, well, I think I'll try to do something productive. I already did laundry, but I think I'll try to do one more thing productive. I think I'll go clean the kitchen or something. And then I'm going to try and do something fun or like do something like gentle fun that maybe Sean can do tonight because I know that sometimes you know he feels really bad for like days in a row and um, obviously that can have an effect on his mood so I think I'll try to think of something a little more fun and uh, playful to do to see if that'll help him feel better. I don't know. It's worth a try. Poof! Can you eat my hair? Does mom have crazy hair? Gross. <laughs> oh, Tibbs, I love you. I love you. Thank you. Do you want this? Do you know what this is? This is a sweet potato. Go ahead. Something new for you. 
Grab it. It's cold. It was in the fridge. I'm sorry. Mmm. <laughs> Do you like that one, Gibbs? <laughs> hey, bud. Yeah, you eat that. She going out with your, your tooth that's coming in. Poor little teething baby. Oh, it looks like you ate half. Oh, good magic trick. Yeah. Hello, little messy cretin. You have something on you. Just, you know, there and there and there. How are you? What do you think of the sweet potato? You ate a little bit. He mostly just put it in his mouth and then spit it back out. But at least he tasted it. <laughs> we'll try again tomorrow. In the meantime, what? I have a beautiful sponge bath prepared. And the landing site is also prepared. Hello, Persephone. Hi. How are you? It is 9.10. The baby is asleep. The other big baby is asleep. And as usual, Nat is holding down the fort single-handedly. Dinner's on. That's ground turkey. It's gonna go with rice and veggies. Oh, I know. <laughs> so exciting. Um, I kind of cleaned the kitchen earlier, but who cares about that? What else is going on? Oh, that's right. I checked in to tell you that... Oh, these things really blind me. I came to tell you that it's 9 o'clock and the baby is asleep and I've checked on him a few times and he's staying asleep. So, my conspiracy to wake him up early and keep him up most of the day <laughs> worked. We'll see if I can keep it up and get him back to uh, normal. I think being out of town for a week really messed with him. So we'll see how many days it takes to catch him back up. But today was a success. Well, hello again. It's me. I know. The boys ditched me. They've been asleep for like more than an hour now. I ate dinner by myself. It was very lonely. But it was still very tasty. The cat is here to keep me company. Come here, Persephone. Come here. Hi. So me and Persephone are holding down the fort now. And we are going to call it a night. Thank you so much for joining us today. If you liked what you saw, please let us know by clicking that subscribe button. You can even ring the bell if you want to get notifications. You know you want to. Come on. Other than that, we'd love for you to comment down below and share with a friend that you think might like it. You know, sharing is caring. That's how it goes. We'll see you tomorrow, guys. Bye. If you liked it, subscribe. If you liked it, thumbs up. If you liked it, comment.